My name is Maddie Marmer. And my name is Celine Moore. Um, so we just sat through uh, the media scrum uh, with uh, the upcoming USC slates so for the elections next week. Yep, we were among the other USC media outlets, which are CHRW, the radio channel. Yeah, and the Gazette, so the on-campus newspaper. Yep. Um, so yeah, I guess we're just going to talk to you about some of the things that we took from it, um, just what we thought was interesting. So do you want to start us off? Totally. Um, one of the questions was asked about the Executive Research Retreat, which for students who do not know already, is a trip that the USC execs take uh, the summer going into their term yeah. to research other university councils, unions, and governments. But yeah. the kicker for us here is that they're going to American universities to do this. So they're yeah. not actually going to Canadian universities where no. we're dealing with the same system, the same structure, that sort of thing. They're going into the States and trying to see what they can take from there. And it's costing quite a bit of our money. Yeah, like, students' uh, money. Several thousand dollars. So yeah. um, I guess Team Helfin said that he would cut this all together. And put the money towards team building um, experiences that are on the local level that cost a lot less money. Like he uh, gave the example of rope courses. Yeah, so just building actual team... Uh, Dynamics within, yeah. Yeah, camaraderie, I guess, between the USC members. Um, and Bellman said that he was sort of not able to comment on on the moment. He didn't know whether or not it would be effective at this time or a call that he could make at this time during the campaign. Mm -hmm. um, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and then another question that was asked was about the uh, student experience. So what does that mean? That so we political all know jargon. Exactly. Yeah. Um, so Banak wanted to take it, took it on and said that, you know, it's a multitude of things, something he couldn't explain in two minutes, but uh, he wanted to emphasize on, you know, are students enjoying their classes, their profs? Um, do they enjoy res life? Relationship, what's their relationship like with the USC, you know? Um, and, you know, that he wants it to be more of a home for students than, um, than just a place that they come for classes and then go home. So he wants them to actually enjoy their time on campus. And one way that he said that this would be measured would be through, um, you know, just asking students next year, what can the USC to improve your experience here at Western and just having fewer things um, for them to list off. Um, yeah, I guess, I don't know. And so Helfin's team, they talked about building community through programming and advocacy. That's how they would build this community, the sense of that. Um, and then emphasize that it's everybody has a different student experience. So kind of a, an empty answer there. Well, um, at the same time, it is a pretty empty political word. Like, so the fact that we caught kind of empty answers pretty much makes sense to me. Do you think uh, we should cut out the idea of the best student experience altogether? I don't know. Maybe uh, we'd like, uh, maybe. We'd like to hear from you about that. Tweet us at the Big Purple Couch what the best student experience means to you. We also learned today in the debate um, about <laughs> the politics of kiosks and what they right. mean to yeah. different candidates, aka those electric boxes with screens that sometimes do not work in the UCC. Yeah. Uh, yeah. What so else? Bellman's team wants to get those back up and running and more do more for you. And, and Halfen just wants to boot them out of there. They don't make sense. No. Nope. Um, yeah. No. I think. Uh, I mean, there was obviously a lot more talked about, and we'll post a video of all of our coverage online. Um, uh, and I guess we'll learn a little bit more about um, each Slate's student experience tomorrow on the couch with Early and Maddie here. Yeah, it's going to yeah. be great. We're going to be playing some wedding games or something like that. I don't know. It's from the newlywed game. game. The newlywed game. 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 Yeah. yeah. It's all right. Be a lot of fun. So check that out tomorrow. Uh, thanks for watching, and uh, we'll talk to you soon. Thank <laughs> you.